Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on relevance of inverse functions. Inverse functions are used extensively in real life, although we may not realize this fact. For example, we sometimes convert degrees Celsius to degrees Fahrenheit. The inverse of this conversion is going from degrees Fahrenheit back to degrees Celsius. Whenever you undo something that has been performed initially, you are essentially performing an inverse function. A very simple example occurs when you deposit $100 into your bank account. Afterwards, you decide to reverse that transaction and withdraw the exact same amount of money. You have performed an inverse function. A mathematical example would be as follows. You may be asked to find the exact area of a circle in terms of pi when given the radius. The inverse function would be to find the radius of the circle when you are given the exact area in terms of pi. In conclusion, an inverse function undoes something which has initially taken place.